Okay, guys, we're still here at the Kremersche Kunstmühle, but we changed location a little bit. So we walked down a couple of meters to actually look at a project, which is really a pilot project that you guys have implemented here, the hydropower turbine, right? And we see it right behind us. And I'll just hand over to you. Maybe you tell us a little bit about it. Yeah, this is our first pilot installed 2011. Um, the first um, kinetic hydropower turbine in Munich. Um, kinetic hydropower turbine means uh, you use the flow of the river, you don't build up a dam, you just um, use the flow to produce energy. The big advantage is that you don't need any constructional work, mm -hmm. just very, very little. Okay. And this is, a, um, for this reason, a very good solution for rural electrification. Okay, very good. And it's actually part of a hybrid solution, right guys? So tell us a little bit about it. What's hybrid? Yeah, well, um, at the beginning when we started with the kinetic hydropower turbine, um, we said we make a one-fits-it-all solution, mm -hmm. but what we experience in the, in the market is that in, in the Amazonas region you have like rainy seasons, very fast rivers, but during the dry season you have slower rivers. Mm -hmm. and, to, and it makes very much sense to add their solar power to use the advantage of both technologies. Okay, very good. And you have not only done this in the Amazonas forest, but we're actually here in Munich, which is not the Amazonas, <laughs> just to make sure. Um, but you have installed a solar site here as well, right? Yeah. <laughs> and here in this particular um, place, we have installed solar as well um, to test our equipment. But um, for rural electrification, we have a very good case in Marisol, which mm -hmm. is in per Peruvian jungle. Okay. And um, we are um, aiming to do it as well in, um, in Nigeria, in Zambia, in India, Indonesia. So we are quite... And how many countries do we have installed right now? Yeah, at least 10, 12. 10, 12 countries. And what's yes. the long-term plan? How many countries do you want to reach? <laughs> yeah, our touched markets are now in Asia, Africa okay. and South America because there are a lot of communities that really don't have access to electricity or mm -hmm. very limited access. And most of them rely on diesel generators that are very expensive, also harmful to the environment. And yeah, we try to provide them this solution. Okay. Enter the Empowering People Award 2015. Apply now.